With Adobe Falls being located across the Interstate 8 from campus, it is no surprise it is a popular destination for students. However, with the recent dangers presented to individuals who visit the falls, San Diego State Police Department has been forced to heighten security in the area. I'm Corporal Mark Peterson. I've been with the police department here at San Diego State for about six years, and I've recently been appointed as the community relations officer for the department. Adobe Falls is a uh, nature reserve just kind of to the north of campus. The San Diego River runs through it. So it's owned by this, the university, and it's been determined it's really never been an open use area. It's always uh, kind of been closed to the public. It's recently gotten some new attention uh, due to a sudden and strong online presence from folks who've been going down there. Uh, we recently added some new no trespassing signs as well as increased our patrols and enforcement in the area. We've also been trying to make notifications via social media every time we see posts uh, about people going down there uh, that is trespassing, that they're not permitted to go down there. And it is not only San Diego State students who venture to the falls, Corporal Mark Peterson explains. We have everyone from high school students going down there to hike to parolees accessing the area with various intentions. Uh, there's an incredible amount of graffiti down there that's disturbing, going as far as 10 feet up tr live living trees. At this point, it's illegal for any unauthorized access to the falls, so to avoid potential legal consequences, it's definitely a good idea to avoid the falls. <laughs>